Hi guys! So, ito na yung next vlog ko. And the topic is, anong gagawin mo kapag iniwan ka ng jowa mo? <laughs> no, seriously. I mean, what will you do? You know, if, you know, just in case. And it all happens too often. If your boyfriend or girlfriend breaks up with you. Okay, so no need for drastic measures. And, well, the first thing and the key thing here is you guys chill. <laughs> okay, I know it hurts, but, you know, everybody hurts. Mm. So, um, what will you do, Deba? What will you do um, if your um, boyfriend or girlfriend breaks up with you? Well, again, just being called it. Una, una, chill. Okay, chill. You know, um, I know it hurts, but, you know, what you will do is essentially, like, um, just take care of yourself. Um, I know there's a lot of impulsive thoughts that would come up to your mind. And, you know, you might think that, you know, you can, like, um, storm to them or, like, um, um, do like an angry message, you know, um, but the nyo sila ng, um, whatever, you know, um, marami, diba? You can like, um, get into some violent actions, or you're angry, diba? I mean, if they did something wrong, you know, um, it's okay, now you can really tell them, you know, that, um, yeah, you know, you hurt me, you're bad, you're a bad person, you know, and you can actually like, you know, cuss on them, and, I mean, that's really what it is. Especially kung hindi naman, like, you know, um, criminal action. So, you can't really file a complaint against them legally, diba? You're um, in a relationship, girlfriend, boyfriend, not really marriage, diba? It's not adultery or anything. So, um, you just have to chill, okay? So, um, I know it hurts. And um, honestly, for me, I've never been through breakups. Because I never had a boyfriend since birth. <laughs> so um, I'm like talking from like not a place of experience. But from um, the perspective of like, you know, like of somebody who sees breakups and um, who actually like, um, you know, um, just think about like the outcomes of like, you know, the actions that we take. Okay. So kung, kung ganun na nag-break up na kayo. So, magagalit kayo, you know, you can go to them and tell them, na, yeah, you're angry, okay? And, like, uh, you don't want to see them anymore. And um, you can cuss at them. It's okay. I mean, that's not, that would count as verbal assault in America. But um, they broke up with you, and essentially, um, it could be because of some reasons na um, hurtful then, diba? Uh, maybe they ask for like you know something that you didn't want to get or you didn't want to give like um like um like let's say um for some reasons like um boyfriends you know asking for like sex you know it happens diba right? and you know you just have a pledge and i remember ganun yung kay um kiniki hill diba right? Na they have like a pledge of like um celibacy before marriage, so abstinence. So um, if you really you know, you can't really do it, then don't do it. You don't want to do it, then don't do it. You know um, and if they don't support you, it's because they're not with you. They're not with you, then you don't need them. You know whatever doesn't serve you, let them go. Okay, so that's what I do. So I'm always happy. So anyway, um, like um, for girls, naman, you know, let's say um, they ask for money, they don't have the money, or you just don't want to give their money, you know, and um, you know, you're not having um sex, you know, you're just like uh, they're just expecting more of you that you just don't really want to give for boys. So then, they break up with you. It's okay. You know, um, kumagalit because they didn't get what they want and they break up with you, it's okay. You know, um, you can tell them, you know, um, get it off your chest, whatever you need to get it off your chest, tell them. 
And um, you know, um, kung humaba pa, siniraan nila kayo somewhere. You know, um, common friends, sinabihan kayo na, you know, you need like some therapist, you know, cause you're mental, ganto, meron pang gaslighting, pag ganon. Well, then actually, like, um, um, kung kayo na confront ng common friends niyo about it, you just, you know, um, deny it. Okay, tell them it's not true. Tell them that, um, you know, you don't want to talk about it. You know, if it's somebody you trust, you know, tell them that um, they're very angry and that, um, you know, they want to retaliate, ganon. But essentially, if it's somebody you don't trust a lot or you're not, they're not really close to you, you know, then just tell them, uh, well, you don't want to talk about it. And people just have to respect that because, you know, um, people just have to respect your privacy. And if they, you know, they force you to talk, well, you know, it kind of like um, would be very hostile for them to do it. And um, it could be like, you know, harassment now. So, hindi naman sila, you know, like media. <laughs> diba? Media nga, minsan, ano, pwedeng mang harass din. So, um, like, katulad nung kay Princess Diana. <laughs> but anyway, that's not the topic of our discussion. And I don't want to like, you know, um, segue too much. But, um, kung talagang, you know, um, you know, pinagkalat nila kayo, you know, um, they're really talking shit about you. You know, essentially, there's nothing you can do about it. Um, just make sure na kapag sila, you know, um, lumapit sila sa'yo or something, tell them straight to their face na, um, you remember that day, <laughs> you know, that you badmouthed me and I just kept quiet and, you know, um, you're just really like, um, you know, you can't control your anger, you know, it was very damaging for me. And, um, you know, I can't help you because, um, I'm not Mother Teresa. Okay. And, um, you know, just taste your own medicine. Okay. And, um, don't ask help from those that, you know, you make, um, them eat your shit. Okay. Cause um hindi tama yun, diba? So um so chill lang kayo, you know. Um it is gonna be hurtful, but then um you know in the first place, bakit nga ba sila yung pinili yung maging karelasyon or girlfriend or boyfriend, diba? So you know you think about it, and then you come up with the idea na agen yung palasala, diba? So you know think about it and malalaman mo na. Maybe you just made a mistake, okay? They're not the right person for you, okay? And so you just move on. You know, you made a mistake, okay? They're not really like you. You don't have a lot of common grounds to begin with. Because if it was you, you're not going to do the same thing, diba? So you're not going to do the same thing. You're not going to be, like, you know, damaging to another person. So you are not really meant to be together. So you made a mistake, you know, um, essentially you thought they were like, you know, a good person for you, a great person for you, but they were not, okay? But, you know, they just changed their mind, ayaw na nila sa inyo. Okay, so, well, maybe you both just made a mistake of like choosing each other, and then you just let it go, and then you move on, you know? Don't think of like, you know, um, dating back again right away. Because you're processing this, like, you know, hurtful events. And um, essentially, you really need to, like, just, you know, um, chill, take care of yourself, and um, move on. And then, you know, next time, kung interested rin kayo sa iba pang, um, you know, partners, then you can start all over again. But, you know, it's going to be, like, you know, painful. and But you have to process it. And... You know, make sure it never happens again. You know? Kasi kung maulit yan, hindi na kayo natuto. Diba? So, just make sure na whatever mistake you made na you've been with the wrong person, next time, hindi nyo na uulitin. Okay? Para healthy relationships tayo. And healthy relationships make of, make good people. Okay? So, yun lang yan. Um, that's all for the um, topic today. And um, the next topic, ay abangan nyo. Bye-bye.